Okay, today is June 21st on Monday. Is it Monday? Yeah, Monday. I'm gonna comb my hair because it's knotted in the back. Really knotted. Look at how much hair I have left. Nothing. If I get to two, or I have to just, it's gonna be bald. But my hair, my legs is starting to grow back, so maybe this will last a little bit longer. But this shouldn't happen. I mean, so you know I'm still losing hair when it gets this knotted. I have to comb it because it just feels bad. Just have to because it's so knotted in the back. Okay. Mm. We have a front face thing, huh? Mm -hmm. That's all right. <laughs> it's normal when it's like yeah. this. Bring it back your 90s wave. <laughs> oh, you should spray detangler. No, no, it's okay. It's just, it really, it's hardly, it's not, it's not a lot. It's just taking the hair out. I know. It's but like, then I, I want to pull on the hair that's, that's still in there. But it's just like if I do it like this. Mm -hmm. See, because look at it, it's not really. Oh, okay. It's just the it hair just that's falling like out. It. Yeah. Uh oh, not too much. If I do it like that, it's just real easy. It's <laughs> marshmallow. I always do that every night. <laughs> Show us a picture. Okay. Okay, it's still coming out. Thought I was getting lucky here. When was the last time you brushed it? Last week. I like re it's, it hasn't been a week. Mm -hmm. Remember, I have to post a video. Someone was asking me about it. <laughs> All right. So, I don't know if you can see. I can't tell. I'm holding this way. That's my hair. I don't know if you can yeah, hold on. I can see in the mirror. <laughs> What have you been doing for your hair, like when you go out and stuff? Nothing. I keep it in this braid every day. I don't take it out. It's been in a braid since I started chemo. For those of you who haven't seen this, it's a hat with hair. Hey, bango! Bango wing! <laughs> they had one with the hair color better but I didn't order it. I mean, I have to order it. I just, I ordered several different ones, but um, I have like a halo one that matches my hair perfectly. But if I keep my hair in a braid and just tuck it in, it looks, <laughs> God, I wish my hair looked this good still. Oh my it God. Will, it will again. Oh, but this one's so soft. Yeah. It's really nice. 20 bucks on Amazon. It's nice because you're constantly wearing hats anyways, even yeah, before yeah. this, you, you always wear like your black cap. And, and I stuff, have wore so. this out, so no one's noticed. One of my friends commented one time, she's like, I said something about my hat with my wig. She's all, what? And I said, yeah, yeah. She goes, oh my God. She goes, when I saw your video, I she goes, I thought she said she lost hair. <laughs> so, yeah. So, it's so cool. It's so luxurious. And bouncy like a tenting pro. Yes. Special. 
They had so much straight <laughs> hair and then a bob kind of thing, but I like this one because I had long hair. And this is about the length. Of, my hair was a little bit longer than this. So. Yeah, that's what's up. <laughs> so, anyways, you can get this for 20 bucks on Amazon or look like this. Yikes. <laughs> <laughs> and you haven't tried using that, like, that fiber fill-in stuff that everyone... Yeah, I don't spray on. anything because I always have a hat or a cap. So I haven't been doing anything, yeah. but I don't know, I'm just seeing how long this lasts because I don't know, I can't tell. It looks like there's less. I mean, yeah, it looks like it, but then I'm not really combing it too much. Yeah. And the other fact is that, uh, <laughs> uh, and, uh, uh, it just, there's hardly any hair left, you know? Yeah. And since the hair is growing on my hair, on my leg, maybe, Maybe, oh, yeah. maybe it's so. Uh, we should start looking for regrowth on your scalp. Well, you can't really tell except for this is the area I think you'd tell. Mm. But it's it is then because mm. you were look at. Oh, wait a minute. There's no way you've grown that much hair back already. Oh, right there. It's so white I can't see. Yeah. Uh, I don't know if you guys can see it, but yeah, there's. No, some of it just did Because I thought it was pretty bald there. It is bald. But it's oh, not. I can kind of see something here. All that right there. No, because look at this side. This side, see this, like, the, it's white. Oh. It just stayed, like, Maybe. I think just stayed some areas. Maybe it is new. I don't know. I'll have to do a little spot check. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but, yeah, the hair on my, my legs is growing back full strength, so. <laughs> that didn't last too long. Pokies are back. Yeah. <laughs> Anyway, so this is what I do. I just keep it in a braid. I had it in two braids until I couldn't make two braids anymore because I like to keep it in two braids because it seems like when I lay down, it gets more knotted right here. And if I part it in the middle, it's tight where it keeps mm -hmm. the braids. Um, uh, I feel like it, I think it's better to have two braids, but now I don't have enough hair really to do two braids. So I've just been doing one. And I'll do this until I don't have any. Let's see, I hope this lasts. No, if it could just stay here and then just keep growing it. I know. <laughs> That'd be Anyways, nice. So And how far out are you now? You're... So May sixth was my May sixth, twenty twenty two was my last chemo. Today is June twentieth? Twenty first. Twenty first, so May. So uh, a month and two weeks. Yeah, so about six weeks. A right? month and a little, almost eight, little over eight weeks or no? Yeah. So you're a month 14, and yeah, so a month and two weeks. weeks. So six weeks. eight weeks. No, I'm I'm sorry, six weeks. Six, <laughs> six weeks out. Yeah, six weeks out. And you started your radiation last Tuesday, yeah. so it's been exactly mm -hmm. a week now. Yep. I have two more weeks to go. So far, I got my port out, which I'm happy about because now my neck doesn't hurt. I haven't had no pain. What, whatever reason, I don't know why that was causing it, but um, I ha my skin has been more sensitive as far as like when I'm out in the sun. But I asked the doctor today, and um, she because I was driving in the car and my legs felt like they were on fire, and I had um, thermals on and hiking pants, and um, she said that wouldn't really it wouldn't be caused by that she said she's not sure what that is but um maybe it's from the chemo i don't know i have to talk to my doctor about it because yeah, they said the radiation would only really make the area of your skin that's getting the radiation more sensitive to the yeah. sun right and then so i noticed that the inside of my left breast which is the one where they took the tumor out of um it's getting a little bit red on the inside mm. not a whole lot but i'm i'm using biofine and I just bought the stuff that he wanted me to do today. I forget what it was. Clay. Aqua 4 and um, I can't remember what it is. I'll look at it. But I've been using biofine because a girlfriend bought it for me. And it's supposed to be really good for sunburns. And so that's what happens with the radiation. So that's what I've been using. So we shall see. I'll keep you posted. If it gets red, I'll try to take a picture of the inside of where I think it's red and show you. But other than that, there's my braid. Okay, hanging in there. Hanging in there. <laughs> All right, folks. See you next week. Okay, bye. Bye.